matter of time. All right, hanging out on the couch with Chris today is none other than DeBron, DB, uh, Mr. More Than a Space.com, DB Entertainment, The Studio, Liberty Tax Service, JB Lawn Service, Miss D's Daycare? Yeah. What? Yeah. Daycare, DeBron? Yeah, you have really? half of it, so that's enough right there. Oh, Can't wow. let everybody know everything that you're doing. Oh, and okay. most importantly, Dad. Dad, Dad, yes, and I have to admit, since that's not what we were going to start, but since he brought it up, this is a great father. I love talking to DeBron because when he talks about his kids or what he's doing, he's always incorporating them and he's always talking about how to teach them how to become great members of society, productive members of society, and I have to admit, you don't get that a lot in the African American community, so I have to applaud you on that, DeBron. Well, it's one of those things. I don't want to apply because that's what I'm supposed to do. However, true. we have to break a cycle. Okay. Have to break a cycle. And that's a great segue into what we were going to discuss, mm -hmm. but it's deeper than just the outside things. It starts at home. It starts before that. So if we're not giving our children the knowledge and tools to, for them to go out into society and know right and wrong, you know, we, we're not doing our job. But I can't take all the credit. I have great moms that help, you know, give them that balance in life. So I'm very blessed in that aspect. I have to give them a shout out. Can't yeah, do it by myself. That's that's rare too, because it's not often you're gonna get the dad giving the mom the props because usually they're always at odds. But you have a great relationship with I the do. mother of your children. I do, absolutely. We understand that it's better for us to work together for our children. Mm -hmm. You know, we've all had our ups and downs, but at the end of the day we're in it for you're our children. You're not married. So, no, I'm not right. married. Okay, and I'm you know, I'm gonna put a little number at the bottom of the screen in case you want I'm just kidding. <laughs> At four seven one tax or two two one hair, which is a studio. Y'all yeah, know I'm always working, so mm -hmm. <laughs> you'll be able to catch me one of those. And that's one of the reasons why you have not settled down yet, because yeah. um, your enterprise takes priority right now, and you have to be able to find a woman that can actually adjust to that, who right. can accept that, right? Right. So tell me about that. that. That's that's one of the things as a businessman, an entrepreneur, not a lot of women can understand my goals in life and what I'm trying to do. And they have to be a very secure woman to understand that, that it comes my family and my children and then my work and my livelihood. So if they can't fit into that circle, I just don't really have time for it at this uh, point. That's but, special one, you know, and I, I have to stay focused. I have to stay focused. Now ladies, I'm gonna give you a clue as to one of the things that might catch your attention. Braun has a shoe thing, loves oh, shoes. Oh, it's a foot fetish, oh, it's a foot fetish. the whole, okay. Shoes. So the whole thing. Did I just tell the whole world that? It's okay. Everybody knows already, hey, don't hey, they? Hey, hey, hey listen. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. Nice toes, pretty, and it goes up to the legs, and then, oh, we're going to stop right there. But, yes. Please and thank you. <laughs> <laughs> so how long have I she known you? Let's, just, let's, let's talk about, the, let, let's, let's talk about the history here, because we, this is, you're not just some successful, handsome, strapping lad that I have on my couch with me today. We have a history. DeBron and I go back, I mean way back. As a matter of fact, the Cassie Project was established for Cassandra Betts. This is DeBron Betts, no relation. However, we now met- Now y'all know my government. See, everyone don't know my government. This is only exclusive with Chris Styles that you get my government. Yeah. So, DB, go ahead. <laughs> DB and I met when I was doing radio, um, WCIN, and we had a holiday drive, Thanksgiving drive. Yep, and we delivered turkeys together. We delivered turkeys to families. Remember when we went to the house in Evanston and I had to go all the oh, way upstairs? Oh, I sent her, because I didn't want to go. Yeah, he was talking about, I've got to watch the truck. <laughs> really? You know, I have to make sure, you know, everything you know, is good right, outside. Right, that story. <laughs> I mean, you know, you looked like you were in great shape, you know, so I That was what, like 10 years, 10? No, that was 20 years ago. No, that was like 99, That was when I worked at my other, when I had a job. So that's been about 10 years, absolutely. And what's great about that, DeBron was telling me as we were making our rounds to deliver the turkeys to the families, he was telling me about his vision. You know, you hear guys talking about, I yeah, I was running my mouth, but no. I, Yeah, a lot. Um, so, <laughs> I mean, he was like, you know, I want to be a promoter, I want to do this and bring such and such and do this and open a club and just all of this stuff. And I'm like, yeah, and how many guys have said, you know, they want to do this, that, and the other? I'm like, all right. But as the years passed, DeBron wasn't one of those guys that just talk about it. DeBron was about it. And I'm so proud of you. Oh, I'm, I'm so shy. You know, I appreciate that. <laughs> and, you know, the support, you know, the community support. Mm -hmm. You came out and did my birthday party two years ago, hosted that for me. You know, just not losing those relationships as right. you continue to right. grow. You know, I posted something on Facebook the other day saying that the um, steps to success, success is what holds the ladder together. 
you know, I really mean that. You have to keep those relationships and build. But back on the Cassie project, because you know how it go. So uh -huh. I'm going to let you lead this interview. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I don't mind. We want to get inside the head of DB. Okay. No. It's, it's, it's clear in my mind, and everyone doesn't get the vision. Mm -hmm. But my goal was to show people mm -hmm. and then show them what how to be a part of the vision. In the meantime, we're putting together this huge network. Mm -hmm. We don't talk all the time, but we know when we call each other, we're there for each other, and that's what it's about. You know, you're doing something positive here. How can I help? You know, let's let's get it. It's really simple. Thank you. I appreciate that. Let those rumors begin. Chris is me be sitting on Woo! the couch. K I S S I S. K H Y S. I am Yeah. All right. Well, you know what, Devon? That was really. That was really great. Thank you so much for sharing. Thank you so much for supporting. Matter of time. It's a matter of time.